Right guys, hope you're well. I'm going to show you how to set these things up, which are called corner blocks. Now there's many different variations, these ones. I don't actually know the brand of them, but they're, they're the most commonly used ones and they're really good and solid. So, yeah, what we need is our line, obviously, and two corner blocks. Right, so what we need to do first, with our unravel it a bit and put what you call a hitch in it. Now if you just watch my hand, basically you're just tying it a knot in the middle okay so you put your finger like that and then the top through there and then you want the hitch to be in the middle all right so if you drop your line the whole lot does not unravel if you're up a scaffolding it's even worse if you're up a scaffolding but yeah so that's what you call a hitch you might uh, need to google that so basically you just round your finger like that and then back underneath and then make sure it's in the middle so there's two hitches on there once you've got your hitch you want to feed the line through the back of the corner block right give yourself plenty because you're going to need to wrap it up and what we want to do is we want to do a figure of eight movement so just just hold the line in place there and just basically snap it in and do figure of eights a few times there's no set amount or anything just whenever you think right and then just give it a couple of wraps and there we have it so got our corner block on there place it on your profile see where it dropped and the hitch saved it didn't unravel all right, so now we're going to set up the other one. So keep keep the tension on the line, okay, and, and push in like that. And pull out, it might come off. Keep the tension on. Tension. Tension. Wait till we find our other. All right, I'm going to go past here. I think we've already got a hitch on here. Yeah, we've already got a hitch on here. But you want them in the, in the middle, because if you put them there, they're hard to... Uh, they had to unravel. Again, feeding our corner block through here to the line. All right, so we've got plenty on. Now the thing is with lines, now you want them nice and tight. Nice and tight like a tiger. No, you want them nice and tight. So I generally go, I pull it tight and then a brick and a half. No, depends on the line, obviously. This is new line, it's quite solid. Uh, so I'm gonna go half a brick. So when it's nice and tight, there, you want to do again, figure of eight, snap it in place a couple of times. There we go, and give it a couple of wraps. Now be careful, right, because you don't want that knocking your teeth out. Get it with both hands, just give it a pull, and then on the corner block. There you have it, and we want it to make a nice twang. Ah, right. do you hear that twang? That's what we want. <laughs> right, okay, so that's how you set up corner blocks. I'm thinking of doing more videos like this, short ones, just to keep you in the know about stuff like this. Mostly you see just jobs on me, on my channel, but I think these are very helpful for you as well. So that's how you set corner blocks and line up. Yeah, this is what you call, underneath it here, this is what you call a dory block, right, and this allows you to fire the line through to that profile there without using a corner block okay so we just set a profile up there then this end put the corner block on there and what happens with the dory block is i'll show you i'll show you now actually i'll show you now why you're watching because i appreciate you right oh, <laughs> that's come off <laughs> but basically what happens here is our dory block our line fires through okay we wrap that there like you so Come round here, okay. Like that. This same same thing here. Figure of eight. And then it clips round this little pin here. Alright, and it allows us to fire our line back down there. Now that is awesome, isn't it? And it's just a case of what happens with this now is we unravel it. Okay, sorry, unscrew it and then you lift it up to your gauge points every time you go up a course fantastic piece of kit and that's what you call a dory block right thanks very much for watching this little short video appreciate you see you in the next one